TNTM The Show presents... August Talking Nerdy. With your host, Pablo Gunner. The Ambassador. I'm Marvin Goof, baby. And we are here to talk nerdy to you about all the nerdy stuff, or as much of the nerdy stuff that we could cover as possible for the month of August. So we're going to be covering Young Jedi Adventures Season 2. And then we're going to do some shout-outs, talk about the merch, and uh, talk about what our charity of the month is going to be for September. Cool. Uh, I'm going to talk about Young Jedi Adventures Season 2 because my kiddos, and so we watched that, and once again, this continues to have great character development and is really interesting. I think it actually takes place in... High Republic era, and I, because I think there's a character, I'm not sure exactly, but I think there's a character from Acolyte that is in this or shows up in this, and so I was like, okay, yeah, that looks like the same doofy character. I was like, it might, it might be, I don't know, it looks like him at least. It doesn't, it doesn't necessarily sound exactly the same, but he looks like him. But yeah, it's, it's, I'm surprised with how good the character development is with this like this pirate villain that they've been facing this entire time and now he's like finally getting some character growth you find out that he's actually a prince yogurt hello boys well you opened your fortune cookie so here's your fortune Lone Star. you know that medallion that you wear around your neck but you don't know what it means well here's what it means it's a royal birth certificate yes your father was a king your mother was a queen which makes you Certified Prince. Hey, I'm a prince. I'm a prince. He's kind of doing the Robin Hood thing, but he is selfish at the same time, so he kind of does it for himself too, okay. you know? So it's it's really interesting how they're developing this character, and as well as the re relationship with the Jedi, and how the Jedi are positively affecting people, right? Mm -hmm. Like how they go, like, how they just saving people, and, and, and how they use talking... Instead, right, like that same thing too, because you have these young kids being like, oh yeah, we're going to fight them. And then the, old, the older Jedi being like, no, we don't have to use our lightsabers. or Let's try to talk this out first, right? Like that's a last resort. Getting that idea too, right, that we saw in Acolyte, you know, and stuff. So that was really cool that they're expanding on that in a kid's show. For like kids and for people that have kids, I definitely say that is a must-see, must-stream. Here Talk Nerd to Me, our grade scale is must see, must stream, unless it's something that you can buy, of course, and then uh, check it out or worth checking out, and then pass. So for shout outs, we have uh, MK Wizard. She is now at the top of that list every time because she's phenomenal. You've seen some of the videos. You may or may not have seen some of the videos I've done with her, and they're great. We have this great conversation back and forth. So definitely check out all of her stuff because it's great. Uh, Film Rage, those guys are hilarious. They cover movies. So if you like, if you're a hardcore movie person, definitely listen to them because they cover stuff ASAP and they'll keep you on on the know. And then they're hilarious. Uh, Pesky Gremlins, they they do web comics like MK Wizard. So that, check that out. Uh, watch it if you can. Podcasts, they're awesome. Amerime Media, they're really cool as well. Um, and then uh, for merch. But yogurt, what is this place? What is it that you do here? Merchandising. Merchandising? What's that? Merchandising. Come, I'll show you. Open up this door. <laughs> Come, walk this way. Take a look. We put the picture's name on everything. For the new month for September, it's going to be... Lord of the Rings. It's mainly going to be focused because everybody loves the books and the movies. So it's mainly going to be focused on that. But we are going to have some Rings of Power merch as well. So keep an eye out for that. It's going to be coming out. And we're going to be uh, leaving our Batman stuff. Maybe come up with some more. I don't know. And um, mm -hmm. of course we're sporting our merch now. Here it is right there. <laughs> we have... This, uh, this hat as well. Is a little oh yeah, the Pokemon hat. Pretty much the Ash Ketchum Tog Nerdy to Me hat. And uh, our magic, the lovely right? Magic the Gathering shirt. This one's my favorite, actually. MTG, <laughs> the good MTG. The good MTG. Yeah. <laughs> so, an ambassador. Got my Ninja Turtles talk nerdy to me shirt. Yes. And uh, and I got one too. Mine's blue tank top right here, and I got the shorts to go with it. Uh, I want the headband and the socks. 
And so if you buy any merch from us, uh, it helps us greatly. I mean, we really don't make a lot of money off the merch, but 5% of any profit that we go to, we have a different charity for the month. And so for the new month, it's going to be AFSP, which is American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, as it is, as it is Suicide Prevention Month. Uh, there's also Hispanic Heritage Month uh, is halfway through the month. That's why I'm not going to do the whole month, but we're going to roll out some merch for that as we have some Azul Beetle and probably some Miles Morales. We'll probably roll that out too, yeah. you know, and then any other characters that we can think of that we, that we love, we're, we're inspired by and everything like that. That's it, unless you guys have anything else. Look out for a review of the new 5th edition Player's Handbook. Awesome. That's coming out in a few weeks. I'll hopefully turn that out here in a bit. Cool. Talk nerdy to me. Stay nerdy, Flat Earth. Keep it nerdy, y'all. <laughs>